welcome back to another video. Hopefully we're gonna get it all done in this video. So I am starting out, it is a rainy Saturday and I just went to Walmart, Sam's and Aldi. So I have a huge grocery haul for you and I'm gonna share with you my two week meal plan. And then I've got a lot of stuff to do around here. I've got laundry, I've got to clean, I've got to do some baking, I've got to do some decorating. Tomorrow is Marion's 50th birthday. And he is, if you know Marion, he's not like an attention seeker. He doesn't want the attention on him. He actually asked if we could just skip that day, which of course we cannot. So we just decided to just have the kids over. That's what he was okay with. That's what they want to do. Of course, they want to see their dad on his birthday. They're going to come over tomorrow after church and we're going to order pizza and play some games and just, you know, take it easy. It's also Super Bowl Sunday, so everybody has plans in the evening. So we didn't want to interfere with their plans, but still have a good time so we're gonna have them over after church tomorrow so I did buy some decorations and some fun things we're gonna do so at the end of this video I'll probably put in some clips of that tomorrow but today I have to do all the prepping I have to clean the house decorate bake some things so I'm gonna put all that into this video so it's just gonna kind of be like a cleaning cooking decorating getting ready for the party so hopefully you like that kind of video hopefully that's why you're here so let's get into the grocery haul because I gotta get gotta get some of this cold stuff put away does it ever fail? He never fails me. He's always right there. <laughs> always the keeper of the drinks. My sweet, sweet Clyde. So at Sam's, I, I figured I'd do by store. At Sam's, I did get the big three pack of bubbly. That's a really good deal and Marion really likes his bubbly. And then the only other things we picked up at Sam's was his coffee and they had these popcorners for six something and it's a big bag. So the smaller bags like this big are like four dollars or something so i thought it was a good deal it's still kind of expensive but that's so big it should last a while Mary, uh, jackson and i both love those um then we went to aldi so i'll swing you around and we'll do the aldi haul over here i uh i think i spent like 50 something dollars at aldi and there's just certain things i know i want to get there i think i say this every time but i'm starting to find more and more things i like to just pick up there rather than at walmart and it just saves me a little bit of money and every little bit helps so I got some granola. Jackson likes granola in the mornings for his breakfast. He also likes to snack on it. So I'm going to try this one. It was only, it was less than $3. So a little bit cheaper than Walmart. So we'll try that. We did get a couple big bunches of bananas. We are loving those. Some gala apples, some baby carrots, coleslaw mix. I will give you my meal plan at the end of this. I got some pepper jack cheese and then their Castlewood meats we really like. This is the uncured honey ham and the oven smoked, oven roasted turkey breast. Then I got some strawberries there. They did not have any grapes, at, any good grapes there or at Walmart. So unfortunately I did not get grapes this week. I got this big thing of applesauce. It's delicious. Um, Marion and I both ate that last time and also he discovered he really loves, he'll take the raisins and mix them with the dry roasted peanuts. It's kind of like a trail mix, but healthy, you know, just those two. He's really enjoying those. We also got three of our favorite barbecue chips and two packs of brioche buns. So Walmart, we got the can, the can cat food and dog food. Got some paper towels, water bottles, some vanilla Coke that Jackson actually, the thing tore when he was bringing it in. Then I got some root beer and Coke for our party tomorrow. And then I got this, I've never tried this Pure Balance Pro. It's for senior seven plus and my dogs are now, Oliver will be 10 this month and Belle is 10. So I wanted to find something senior and we'll try that. We'll see if they like it. I'm not sure if I'll stick with that, but I thought I would try something a little more, you know, cater to older dogs. And then I got some of just this cheap Walmart bread. Jackson has a project at school and he needs to make something. So we're just going to use that for that. And then I got this multi-grain bread, which I love. And his brat buns. He likes to take sandwiches. I got a big old bag of potato chips. And I got some dip. We're going to have that tomorrow at our party. I got a salad mix, a lemon, some celery, cilantro, fresh broccoli, and tomatoes. And then I just got one thing of ground beef. Some chicken cutlets, thin sliced chicken breast, and chicken tenderloins. I got a big one pound block of cheddar cheese, some mashed potatoes, some sliced Havarti. I've actually never had Havarti, but it's what he needs for his project, so that's that's why we got that. Got some mozzarella cheese. These are, I'm going to be making, we, I'll tell you in a minute, but I'm going to be making a dessert for Marion. Also got some flour 
my favorite, the extra toasty Cheddar Jack Cheez-Its. They're so good. Some taco shells, some mac and cheese, two boxes of angel food cake mix. One of those is going to be a recipe that I'm going to actually share. I've never tried it. Um, and Jackson likes to make mug cakes with, with those. And then I got him some sweet and salty peanut and some oat and honey crunchy granola bars. And also his little drink mixes. Got some French onion dip and Cool Whip. Some sticks of butter and a big roll of cookie dough. I'm going to be making a cookie cake for tomorrow as well. Then I got some heavy cream and half and half. I'll be making some couple kinds of soup. Got some ice cream for the dessert I'm making. Some dog treats, milk, and chicken strips. And then I got a lot of cans this week. This hot fudge and then red skin Spanish peanuts and chocolate magic shell are for the dessert I'm going to be making, which I'm going to share in this video. I got some corn, green beans, crunchy peanut butter for a recipe. I'm going to try some, oh no, that is not what I meant. Oh, I meant to get the coleslaw, coleslaw dressing. Well, shoot. I wanted to make my own coleslaw. Um, I saw on Instagram where you can take the Chick-fil-A um, dressing that they have at Walmart and mix it with coleslaw. That's what I wanted to do, but I could not find it. So I was going to get the coleslaw mix. I got the wrong one. Um, honey barbecue sauce. Marion got a bunch of soup. This is the spicy chicken and sausage gumbo. Got two of those. And then he really likes the chicken Cajun style Alfredo. So you got two of those. He just has those for lunches. And then I needed some more vanilla. And then I've been loving these. So I got four of those mandarin oranges. I got some strawberry pie filling for recipes. Some baked beans. Rotel. And then two pear halves. Marion really loves pears. And then a couple non-food items over here. I went ahead and bought the generic Equate brand of the women's vitamins. Because you get so many more for the same price. So I got that for me. Marion's deodorant. And then Jackson needed some body wash and shampoo. Oh, and I also forgot to show you this. This is the Neutrogena Hydro Boost. And I saw Kristen Casper. Um, she always shows this. This is her favorite. And she, her lips just always look so pretty and shiny. And I was like, I'm going to try that. It was almost $9. But it's radiant red. And I'm not sure it was my color. I should have probably gotten a more rosy color rather than this pinky. But it's what I'm wearing now. And I like it. So, yeah. If you're wondering, that's what I got. So I've got to put all this stuff away. I'm going to go get my meal plan so I can share that with you. All right, so in case you're new here, <laughs> I do shop for two weeks. And then the, the by week, the in-between week, I do have to go back and pick up a few other things. I know I will have to get a few things, but for the most part, we're good. So we're going to have chicken gnocchi soup, and I'm going to make a homemade broccoli cheddar soup. I've made it lots of different ways. This is just a new recipe. So two nights we'll have soup. It is soup season, so I want to make that soup before it gets too warm. We're going to just probably have sandwiches tonight because it's a busy day, and that would just be easy. Um, tomorrow is Marion's birthday, and it's also the Super Bowl, so we're going to do pizza. Then on Valentine's, we're going to go out. Then we're going to do sloppy joe and barbecue chicken on a bun. Tacos one night, black and chicken salad, queso dip, loaded queso dip, so good. We'll have leftovers a few nights, and then I also have stuff to make some of these little pizza puffs, which I'm probably going to share in a vlog. I haven't made those in a long time, like years, and they're so good and so easy. All right, so I'm going to put all these groceries away, and then when I have room to lay out, I'm going to show you all the things I got for Marion's party tomorrow. to be the one you can trust I feel so useless cause I let you down I hope there's some way I can make it alright cause I know that you deserve much more than this if you give me one more chance I swear I'll try my best to always be there and I
did I think when Jackson dropped it one of them was like close to exploding and I dropped the whole thing I think we only lost one but oh what a big fat mess Lord have mercy I thought I'd show you a couple things I picked up at Gabe's yesterday because I thought they were fun and add them to this grocery haul. These were only $1.99. I love these cheese it Puffs. They are so delicious and this is the white cheddar, even better. Um, it's not very big. How big is it? 5.7 ounces, but these are really good and I love snacking on those. And then I saw these. They were on sale for $1 on clearance. They were normally $2.49 and I thought, why not? Cookie sticks and cream dip. So for a dollar, that's fun. And then I found great Pop-Tarts. These are so hard to find. They might not be where you live, but where we live, these are so hard to find. I was so excited. These were like my all-time favorite. I love strawberry, but grape is my favorite. $1.79. So I grabbed these. I don't buy Pop-Tarts for me often because they are so loaded with sugar. It's crazy. If you ever check the sugar, you will be shocked also sodium and all that but oh my gosh for a treat every now and then i love great pop tarts i was so happy to find those all right marion is sanding downstairs so he won't hear me talking to y'all so <laughs> i'm going to show you the things i got for his birthday and then well for his party and then his birthday i did order him a shirt on amazon unfortunately it's going to be here the day after his birthday 
but it's a funny woodworking shirt it just says i'll be in my office and it has like a big a guy with like a big saw it's really cute because clearly that's his his office he loves to be down there and then i also got him a gift card to his favorite place harbor freight tools so um the kids and i both know always get him gift cards there and then he puts them together and gets really a lot of stuff he really wants we could never pick out what he wants so it's just better to put it on a gift card also got this frame at walmart it was ten dollars it has a mat on it it's matted to eight by ten and the kids and i all made him i'll show you tomorrow um it's just uh Actually, Elaine is making it for me, but it's something I saw on Etsy, and we just are recreating it. It says, 50 things that we love about you, and then we all just put in, um, where we're going to do them all. Each person have their own color, but it's too complicated. But we're going to actually just, like, have him guess who wrote what, but, and then you just fill it all in. It's really nice, and that's something he can put on his wall downstairs and just look at it and rem remember why we love him so much i just thought that would be a nice gift to give him on his 50th so it's kind of like a couple themes you can go with for 50th you can do like the classy everything's gold and sparkles and 50th or you can just do the funny over the hill so i just thought you know what we'll just do a fun one he is not gonna care so i thought it'd be really fun when i saw this at hobby lobby i thought i gotta go with that he'll he'll get a kick out of it so i'll tell you what i'm gonna do with all this but these are the plates that i went with um they were half off at hobby lobby so 250 for these and it's 20 of them so these will be our dessert plates and then these are the food plates for the pizza so uh, and these how much were these these were only 3.99 you only get 10 but they were half off so i only paid half two dollars for those and those and then i just had green napkins i always keep like leftovers from holidays and stuff so we have napkins and then i found this this is only 99 cents and i'm gonna make a charcuterie board with just candy because if you ask Marion what is his favorite dessert, it is candy. You know, some people it's candy, some people it's ice cream, some people it's baked goods. That's me. I love anything baked. That's what I would prefer. He prefers candy, and honestly, Marion and I have been on a three-week sugar, like, elimination. 100% no sugar, other than what's in, already in foods. Drinking water only and no sugar, and he's lost nine pounds, so that's awesome. So I thought, well, you know what, for his birthday, <laughs> we're gonna just tomorrow is actually when our three weeks ends, so um, he's actually gonna have to control himself. But I just picked up a bunch of candy that I know he loves, and I'm just gonna put them on a round charcuterie board. And I'm gonna put this in the middle, and then we'll just put the candy all around. I'll show you at the end of this video what it looks like. But I got the cinnamon bears, he loves these. And then these were just 75% off, so I thought that was a really good deal. He loves Twizzlers, there's all time favorite, and the bites, he loves those, and these. Peanut M&Ms, I didn't realize these were, oh well, these colors, that's fine. Then I just got these at Walmart, just for some color on the charcuterie board. And I found these at Gabe's. Um, they were only $1.49, I think, but hot tamales are a favorite, and then the little, what are they called like sweet tart ropes man those are so good so if these are like that he'll love them and then i just grabbed skittles boston baked beans milk duds and whoppers all which he loves these would be more for the kids he loves all of those but those would be fun to make a little candy charcuterie board and then i bought these just to put to use for decoration and also two of these so i think i got these for all half off at hobby lobby it just says caution old folks zone so i'm gonna like put these in the doorway I thought those were fun he'll get a kick out of them and then I bought this because when we went to Sam's we were going to get one of the French silk pies Marin doesn't like cake but he loves the chocolate French silk pie and last time we were there we checked and they had them today they did not have them we have been looking forward to that for three weeks <laughs> we've been like oh we can make it till that day we'll have French silk pie but they did not have any so I'm going to put this on the top of it but I am going to be making him another dessert, so I'll probably just put this on that. So we'll still look for the French pie, French silk pie, but we won't have it tomorrow. And then I got an orange tablecloth just to go with those. And these candles, we'll actually put these on the dessert that I make. And then I made a few games that I, I just looked um, like on Pinterest and got some ideas. And I asked Mary a bunch of questions, and he gave me his answers. So we're just going to play like games to see how many of the kids can get right. They're not kids. When I say kids, you know what I mean. <laughs> Um, but I needed some dry erase boards, so I have the, what do we have? The, it's called Telestrations. So I took six of these out of that. I need seven, so um, we, we will just use these. And then I bought one at Walmart so we can have seven. And then we needed some more dry erase markers for that game. And then there's four of them, so I, may, I bought four prizes. And I just figured why not go with food, because, you know, you can't really go wrong with food. So one prize 
will be Milk Duds and Reese's Peanut Butter Cups. One prize would be the Ferrero Rocher. One is the Pecan Delights. And then we just thought that would be a fun gift as well. So those are all the party prizes. And then I'm going to be making him a peanut buster parfait cake. I'll link the recipe down below. It's an ice cream cake. He loves peanut buster parfaits. I keep saying he loves all these things, but he really does love desserts. So, um, we're going to make work, you know, this is a backup plan because they didn't have the pie, but it's, uh, you just layer like graham crackers and one recipe says you can use these. So I haven't decided if I'm going to use these or graham crackers. They didn't have chocolate graham crackers, which is what it called for, but I have to decide. And then you layer, um, chocolate foot or hot fudge, magic shell, vanilla ice cream, and then these red skin peanuts. And it really does taste like a peanut buster parfait. So that's going to be his main dessert. And then I'm also going to make a cookie cake for those that maybe don't want that. And then, of course, we have a candy charcuterie. So we're, we have way too much sugar. Way too much sugar. We're making up for three weeks of not eating it. But um, I can put all those away and he can, you know, have them for a long time to come. So I need to go ahead and get started on the peanut buster parfait cake. I want to see. Or is that what it's called? Yeah, I think that's what it's called. It's not really a cake. It's an ice cream cake. Um, my ice cream is sufficiently melted. I also have these two banners. This one's just white with gold, and this is yellow and black. This one would match perfectly, except it does have Batman on it, so I haven't decided. I'll probably hang one of these up, too. But before I do that, I'm actually going to switch my laundry over because I need to keep that going. This is what I'm making, Buster Bar Ice Cream Cake, and I will link the recipe down below. just going to make a cookie cake so you can take this these cookie dough rolls and just smush it into a large cookie basically and cook it just like you do a regular cook, pan of cookies so um, it's you don't need to grease it but I just did just to make it easier I may take it off of this and put it on something else when it's completely cooled I don't know so I wanted to make it easy to get off So 
while that cookie cake is cooking, I'm gonna go ahead and do some decorating. I'm gonna put these in these two doorways right here. I'm not exactly sure how I'm gonna do it yet, but um, we'll figure it out, and then I'm gonna blow these up. Look at my cozy little boy. He's so cute. Okay, so we got some decorations. He came up and didn't even notice them until he came in the kitchen. <laughs> um, but yeah, he laughed. He thought they were great. So I am, I pulled the cookie cake out of the oven and I'm letting it cool. And I'm gonna, I'm just making, I started out in a bowl, but I was like, I need my mixer. I'm just making a very small batch of buttercream because I'm just do a little decoration on this. It's 6.30 and I've been busy doing this, but I need to make some dinner because I'm getting hungry. Got the laundry still going. My back is starting to hurt, but I still need to do my floors. I need to mop and sweep and all that. So I'm just going to take it slow. <laughs> Try to take it slow because my back is telling me it needs me to sit down. All right. Um, I'm going to let that sit for a little while and let this continue to cool completely once it's cooled completely we can decorate it but Marion's gonna bring up the leaf to the table we're just gonna put the leaf in instead of bringing up those we have two four foot tables put together we did that at Christmas and it worked really good but we're just gonna put the leaf in this and it'll be fine I think for just having the kids over Belle Belle loves the cat drinking fountain do you love that Belle Belle she makes such a mess
gonna sit down and have a dinner break. Just made a turkey and cheese sandwich. Okay, that sandwich was delicious. Um, Marion is cleaning the living room. He's gonna clean the couch and stuff. I'm gonna go ahead and unload this, reload this, and then the cookie cake should be cooled off enough that I can ice that and check that off my list. Do you wanna? Vacuum? Yeah. I always take it into the um, new pantry and the dogs follow me and then I shut the door and keep them in there. Have this feeling. Haven't felt for so long Took a hold of me and won't let go I've been sleeping Caught me off my guard Cause you're in my space and now I'm so Hold me towards you And I can't fight it My head's underwater I try to disguise it Want you to hold me Though we haven't spoken I need that something To get me to open I forgot that I was out of piping bags, so I used one of these baggies and I had to put some tape on it to hold it in. Not my best work, but it's gonna taste good. <laughs> that baggie was not cooperating with me. It kept popping out the size of it, so, because I didn't have any piping bags, so I just, and my buttercream is super not stiff enough at all, but it's okay. I didn't do any kind of measurements. I just threw it all together. I, don't, I didn't wanna make a big batch, so yeah, it's fine, totally fine, and I covered it up, all the mistakes with sprinkles, and <laughs> it's gonna taste delicious, so. Um, that's just for those that don't want the other ice cream cake. We'll have that as well. And now I'm just going to get the rest of this cleaned up and then I'm going to work on sweeping and mopping my floors. Every time I walk back there, I feel sticky from the Coke that spilled. So I was actually going to mop anyway. So that's good.
nothing left you thinking that maybe you're not different. making a gate, a gate for this doorway like the one he made over here the big wooden one for paisley because this doorway is crooked and our gray one that we put up is just so it's such a pain whenever we have to put it up and down so this will be much easier that's what it looks like it hasn't been painted but you know it looks like the bigger one so he was trying to get that done tonight because Paisley will be here tomorrow. I meant to say too, that's why I only did the decorations that far down because I don't want her to pull them. Also, she might pull the tablecloth, but it'll be all right. Um, I'm gonna wrap these prizes with this paper. And I think that's all I'm gonna do tonight. If only I had listened for a while told you I miss your smile I thought of you as a friend who can't let go But when you left I could feel it grow Like a body of water Sleeping through the edges of my soul And getting hard 
right, it is Sunday morning, party day. We're gonna go to church, but I'm gonna try to put this together before we go so that when we get home, I don't have to do it. I went ahead and ordered the pizzas to be ready as soon as we're done with church and we'll pick them up on the way home. Hopefully everything will work out, but this is the candy charcuterie. I'm gonna put that in the middle. I was gonna put this on his pie that they didn't have, so I wonder if I should put it right there, just like tape it to that. I might do that. I decided not to use a charcuterie, just to use this because it has the ridge and the candy will roll off. I just thought this was a better idea, so I think this is a perfect size too. you free I remember all you've brought me through cause you're so good you're so good you were so good to me you were so good so good you were so I slip and fall into the middle Of an ocean full of broken dreams I feel your hand reach out to me To give me what you know I need I remember all you brought me through Yeah, you were so good You're so so good to me You were so good You're so good You were so good to me Yeah, Through it all, you will never leave me Through it all, you never let me drown You're the one So 